Hello there. Hello there, the Beastmen finally have a new DLC. It took five years, but they finally have it. Uh, is Torox the Bass Brawl, which is the legendary lord we expected for him to get. And the Lizardmen have another legendary lord, which is Oxyotl, which is very, very, very surprising, considering uh, CA said they were only doing six legendary lords for main factions, so the Lizardmen already have six, and so now they have seven. But I don't mind. I, I like the Lizardmen a lot, so... It's Oxyotl, which is a cool character. He's been in the Chaos Realms a lot, and I'm pretty sure he killed a greater demon of Zinch. I'm pretty sure. I'm not, I'm not too certain. There he is. Torox the Basketball. I don't know what units you'll get. I, I know you'll get the Gorgon. I'm pretty sure. Sure, sorry. Uh, is that it for the game? Silence and the Fury. That's a very nice title. Because uh, he's the chameleon, obviously. He's very sneaky. Giant fucking man door. The Fury, obviously. So, let's talk about the Beastman because... It's been a couple... It's been a very long time since, um... The Beastman have got any love, so... Let's start with them. Torox, obviously, he's gonna be fucking amazing. Hopefully. Um, hopefully they get a new Horde rework, which is the biggest problem that they have. The, um, uh, what's it called, the Bray Word, and hopefully it's a bit like the, uh, Orc War. Uh, hopefully it's like that, uh, like a army attached to your main army. I think that's the only way it can really work, and I don't know if there's a different way you could work. Um, what else? Gorgon. We're probably gonna get the Gorgon or something. I can't remember his name. Something like that. It's like a, it's like a Cygo, a much more beefed up Cygo. Like um, it's a more beefed up Cygo. Let's just go with that. Uh, he looks nice. Bit of chaos, flowing through him. He's not fully covered in brass, unless that is brass. The, he might be brass. Uh, he's probably got a mark of corn. Probably mark of corn, actually. Yeah, he's red. Um, Oxyotl. I wasn't ex. I, I don't know who else would have, would have expected from the. Oxyotl is a good shout, I guess. But yeah, let's just go with Oxyotl. He's gonna be fucking amazing. Jack Axe would have been good. The Eternal Warden. He's in the uh, Grim Hammer Warhammer mod. So, okay, it, it was between him and Chak Axe for, for, for me. Uh, for Torax again, uh, hopefully they get loads of me new mechanics, like uh, Waystones in uh, Warhammer 2 uh, mods. I like areas you go to and you get special buffs. So hopefully he gets that, because they need, uh, hopefully they get the uh, the moon. Uh, mechanic. They hopefully they fix that so it's not fucking terrible like it is now. Uh, next uh, video I'll do will be about the Lizardman units and what we could expect from them. Uh, thank you for watching. Uh, tune in for the next episode. Uh, the video. Please like and subscribe and comment down below.